What's up everyone? Gsmith64 here. And we're taking a look at a game called Sheltered. Now, this game is a survival post-apocalyptic uh, type game where you and your family try to survive as best you can. I'm going to go ahead and just make a quick thing right here. Gender, male, bottom colors, go with, go with white, bam, skin color, white, hair color, brown, boom. Bam. Uh, we'll go with optimistic, and then we'll go well-rounded. Randomize. Hey! Cat! Stop! Female. Bam. Cat! You gotta stop. Go. Go that way. But yeah. So it's just like it's just a survival horror-esque game. It's not even a sort of horror. It's just a survival game. Kitty. We'll go with that. Thomas. Sure, why the fuck not? Mary. I don't want my kid to be a bully. Wait, were you a bully? No, you're well spoken. You are alert. Yeah. We'll call this the Smith family. Pet's name will be Ava. King's pet, and it will be a cat. Yes. We will play the tutorial just so that way it can help me better explain things. Cat, I swear to God, you gotta stop. Come here. You, come here. But this game is just a strict survival type game. You just have to survive for as long as you can, building your shelter as much as you can. Family's entering the place. Kitty! Stop. But, uh, you enter the shelter. Tells you how to look around, all that good stuff. Take a good look at your surroundings. Bam. Press A, add fuel. So, you have to keep things in order. You have to keep your survivors happy and healthy. Food, water, sleep, hygiene, toiletries, uh, sanity, along with keeping the shelter running. So, yeah. As you can see, the generator must be kept running. Select Yang for the task. Have her fix the generator. Make sure it doesn't break. Because all these things have percentages. Like the generator here has a percentage, it will break. Same with the oxygen supply, oxygen filter, and water filter. Character is thirsty, so we must drink some water. Top right corner shows you what you have, food, oxygen, uh, gas, and water-wise. And that's pretty much it. So let's go ahead and get started here with Thomas. Go ahead, scan frequency. Mary, actually, no, not Mary. Uh, Zach, myself, build a small water butt. Because usually in the first couple days, it rains. So you want the small water butt to be built so that way you can have the space for it. Hello, kitty. So now we're going to build another room here. While all that's going on, Mary, I want you to build a bed just so we have it. And then shortly after that, let's see, how's the cat? Cat is fine. Good. 
I generally go with the cat because if the shelter starts getting a little dirtier, uh, mice start spawning. If mice start spawning, the cat will catch them and the food will automatically be given to you. But yeah, so you have to keep the shelter clean, you have to keep everyone happy, and you have to keep everyone alive. You move, yeah, it's telling you you can move stuff around here, all that good stuff. The animal, if you have a dog or a cat, they use the vents to move around, as you can see there. Let's see, who needs sleep? Ah, yeah, you need sleep. Go ahead, start sleeping. <coughs> I'll have myself finish that. Kitty, you gotta stop. What? Hello? What is your issue right now? But yeah, so everything has time. It takes, you can upgrade materials. And your goal is to survive as long as you possibly can. Hello, kitty. Come on. You gotta stop. There's some food. You're being ridiculous right now. So now, as you can tell, Zach is tired as well from mining for so long. So what we're gonna do, have Yang wake up. Zach, you stop. Go sleep. Yang, start working on that again. Mary, go ahead and craft a mop. But yeah, generally I like to build a small water butt because in the first couple days it generally starts to rain. And rain water is a great way to get stuff done very quickly, such as free showers, free bathrooms, all of that good stuff. Which is the goal here. Once this room is finished, hopefully we can build our bathroom. We'll speed up time a little bit here. Speed up time a little more. Zach, wake up. Craft an item. Go ahead, craft a shower. Yang, go sleep. Mary, go craft the bathroom. Thomas, go ahead and craft. Don't need bandages. What do we need for this? We need two hinges for an incinerator. Traps, we don't need those. Trip wire, don't need those. Do need to get to tier two rather quickly on the workbench here. Uh, we can't actually do it now, so let's go ahead and get that going. Because as soon as you get to tier two, the sewer you can build traps and stuff, which you can get bunnies with. Uh, water filter is starting to go, so we need to fit someone on that soon. Speed up time. Yeah, like, we could have caught that rabbit right there if we had traps. Fortunately, we do not. So, god damn, is everyone, like, a light sleeper or something? Like, what the fuck? Courageous big eater. Courage optimistic but coward. Small eater but coward. Small eater unhygienic. Okay, well, we're just going to have to straight up craft a second bed here, but we're going to have to rearrange, nope, rearrange the shelter a little bit here. Do that, craft item. Uh, Mary, since you are the only one that's happy and healthy right now. Go ahead and start cleaning. Yang, get up. Take a suit. And then once you take a suit, you know, go fix the water filter so it doesn't break on us. How is our engine doing? It's at 89. So it's doing fine. How is this? Oxygen filter's at 88. Let's see, Mary needs to use the restroom. So once she is done with that. You can go do that. Zachary, go sleep. Keep everyone happy, healthy, and that's what we want to do. Shortly after we get this done, we're going to go ahead and want to send out an expedition to go get food and all of that. Try and find food anyways. We really want it to rain, 
hopefully sooner rather than later so that way we can get plenty of water we can hold 50 units of water right now i mean this would be plenty for showers and restrooms which is what we want because the sooner we get that the sooner we uh can make people happy that's why we want water we want we want it to rain so that way we can get all this done zach is sleeping yang needs a shower uh, everyone is needs a shower unfortunately so that's the second big mechanic of the game is you could send your people out to, uh, on an expedition to go get supplies or find some attempt to find supplies to make the place a little better living wash that out and then we're probably gonna send you oh my god my people are just fucking constantly exhausted and I hate it Do we have Mary build anything? Yeah, we can have her build traps. That's right. No, nope, don't have rope. Can't have her build traps. Equipped in the next special party, you will recover more items of mine, including mountain passes and caves. May as well just have a fire extinguisher on standby just to have one. Zach, go ahead, get up, use the toilet. Yang, how much have you repaired this? Go ahead, stop. Turn the suit. Go sleep. Zach, once you're done doing your business, we're going to send you and the boy out to get supplies. So wash out. Done washing that out and set up the expedition. Assemble your party. We'll send out Zachary and Thomas. Yeah, this is kind of an unfortunate starting area. Yeah, we only got four water right now. We really need some rain. Whoops. Don't take that. Equip that. Confirm. We want to equip that. If you don't send them with gas masks, there's a very good chance they will get sick. So let's go ahead and send these two out to the wasteland and hope it rains tomorrow or we might be a little fucked. Because we are down to one water. Mary. Sub transmission. Search the location. Hope to God we find water or it rains, because otherwise we'll be fucked. Getting close to the east, drinking water is important. Excessive thirst may lead to dehydration, which can be fatal. Search water when it rains, you can also find water when searching locations at the wasteland. Yeah, I know. But we need it to rain or we need water. We set up an expedition. Alright, what do we find? Two food, two water. Take it. Oh, what the fuck is that? Mannequin heads? Uh just don't don't bother with those. Good, it's raining on the surface. That's what we needed. So since it's raining on the surface, drink water, take a shower. Now once you're done taking a shower, go to sleep. Uh, actually, yeah. You can go ahead and take a full shower. I may just kick you out of bed here in just a second, Yang, just to go have you take a shower. Go ahead, sleep. Perception went up for those guys, which is good. And got a little more food and a little more water. All of which is good and nice. Confirm. Alright, Zach. Drink. And then you will build the 
did not get any rope, unfortunately. So we build a small crate right there. Thomas, let's go ahead and drink. See, Mary is almost done showering. Cat is hungry, feed her. But yeah, it's really just like a survive as long as you can type of game. Zach, go ahead and sleep. Yang, go ahead and take a shower the toilet and then immediately wash it out see because now we're in a good spot water wise because we have 50 gallons of water almost wash it out then clean then we may set up for another expedition shortly after that let's see Drink, eat. So you're not too hungry. Let you sleep. Boy is tired. Set up an expedition of Yang. And Mary, we already went to the farm, the church. We'll go to the small farm, there, and there. Equip, equip, confirm. See, we'll send them with this much water now. And my reasoning for that is, if we send them with this much water now, uh, then we can say okay, we can set out the big expedition now because it's raining which means we'll get so much more water which means they will potentially find some incoming radio transmission we stumble across the farm and, yep search the farm we found something at the farm take the food Take the wood. Go ahead and take the sand for now. I'm being chased by something. Please, I need I need somewhere safe to stay. Uh, no. You stumble across a small house. Oxygen filters at 66, rain, or water filters at 76. A toy. Gasoline. Take the metal. Is there anything you can build here? Can we build a rope? Snare trap. We need rope. That's what we really need right now. We will build a second room right now, just because it gives us something to do. And then lights probably wouldn't be a terrible one either. In fact, boy, can you craft lights right now? And do we have any form of lights to craft? Yep. But we do not have a bulb. Crafting and preparing is slower in rooms without a light. Tell you what, which one of these beds is weaker here? This one? Deconstructed. And then craft just a full blown bed in that spot now. 
Of transmission, Hellas Zing found a church in the wasteland. Yes, go ahead and check it out. What'd you find? A little bit of food. Fuse, not what we want. Might as well take it all. Have the boy go work on this. Have plenty of room for storage. Yang. Deconstruct this, then right after you deconstruct it disregard cancel that we don't have what I thought we had Thomas go ahead and sleep rearrange shelter move the beds into here if we can fit both of them can we nope all right plan B then this is our bathroom Boom. Bam. Martha, help I'm being chased by something. Let me in, please. No. We don't have the supplies to take care of that many people. Thomas, go ahead and sleep. Mary, you are a little hungry, so go ahead and eat. How's this doing? 63%. Go ahead and fix it just to be on the safe side. Water filter is at 67. Oxygen is at 53. Ying, you got time. Go ahead and fix that up a little bit. Mary, once you're done eating, which you are, go ahead and start cleaning. Put that in the bathroom. And once you're done cleaning, I want you to broadcast. Broadcast? Broadcast. For traders. See if we can find someone to trade supplies with. What do I need to up. No, not craft. Upgrade. What do I need to upgrade? Hinges and rope. I really need a rope. What it's coming down to here. Zach. Eh. Rearrange. Put this. Can we put this over here somewhere? Right there. Put both of these boxes over here. This is me just more so making it so my place looks nicer. Yang, what is that at? 80%! Cool and nice. Go ahead and return the suit. Go ahead and feed the cat. Mary, you go ahead and stop, actually. Sleep. Who has high charisma? Charisma is one. Four. Okay, we want Thomas to do this then, actually. Broadcast for traders. Anything we can craft here that might be helpful. Trip wires, bed roll. Hiding spot. Need hinges. Again, we don't have that. 
therein lies the problem. Got a fire extinguisher already, don't need another one. We don't have rope, can't make tier 3 stuff yet. I use a quart and shower reduce which costs a lot of water to use. We need a lot of this stuff, but unfortunately I don't have the things to make it. What is really hindering us right now is rope. So... Zach, go ahead and take a shower while you're doing that. You can go sleep. Simply because we're in a situation right now. Is that a trailer? Spawn. So, nobody can have a bunch of stuff? Yes. Time to trade. You have hinges. Give me all seven of them. So, uh, let's see, so it's a total value of seven. What can I give you in return? I don't need nylon right now. Don't need wiring for a while. There we go. Yes. Use the journal. We're alone. It's just a family now, and that's all that matters is the family for our records. And whoever may find this in the future, Zachary, Yang, Thomas, Mary, and our pet cat, Ava. This place is in shambles. The amount of de uh, degradation here is worrying, but it's better than anything else we've had. We've had to decide, decide to try and tidy it up and turn it into something special. At least we have a roof over our heads for now. Day five. We had a trading pass by today. I did wonder how they managed to cart all that stuff around. They said it took a while, but managed to find a all the parts for our old van to use that as transport makes sense. Wait. They said it took a while, but managed to find all the parts for an old van and use that. Alright, so we can actually build this. The RV offers a huge storage capacity for wasteland expedition and requires less water than traveling by foot. This RV uses petrol and cannot be taken on the expedition without any. Once you have found all the parts of the RV, you can choose it to use it as an expedition setup. But we need a lot of parts for it. So, Yang, you're doing all right. Go ahead, use the restroom real fast. Zachary, go sleep. Don't have a light bulb. Nope. And funny enough, I needed the wiring actually for a light. Hilarious. I want to be a little careful with the water there. See, how's everyone doing right now? You're doing fine. You're doing good. Zach is a little hungry. Uh, once you get up, go ahead and eat. You're feeling a little dirty. Mary, you're doing pretty good, Alan, all things considered. May set up an expedition after Zach gets up. I may just force him to get up here, actually. Yeah, I tell you what. Go ahead and have him get up. And then once he's done eating there, we'll send these two out on an expedition. Set up expedition, Zachary and Mary. Uh, yeah, that's what I was afraid of. There's not really anywhere close. And that would be most of our water to get there. Fuck it. We need supplies. I'm taking the risk. And that's sometimes what you got to do in this game. Equip him with the bag just that way. Uh, let's see. You need required strength of 10 to wield that. A pipe. You need 8. But the goal here is to send these two out. Hopefully to find more supplies. Ooh, rain. That's huge. In that case, Yang, go ahead and get up. Take a shower. We need more lights. No one is really going crazy, thankfully. Thomas, go ahead and eat. And then shower. Respond. 
Hey, if you're still alive in there, I got some nice goods available to trade. What if we make a deal? What do you got? You have lots of rope. I want it all. And the leather would be useful. Tell you what, here's what I'm gonna do. Give me all of this, and I will give you one radiation medicine. It's a little risky to give our anti-radiation tablets, but I really need the ropes, and that other supplies would be helpful to have as well. So, fuck it. Submission, we spawned a small house. What's in the house? Take a look. Water storage is at maximum. View the journal. Day six. I was wondering where these guys get all the trade goods from. It turns out they just pick them up from houses and buildings. People just leave stuff lying around, it seems. Uh, yeah, go ahead and approach the people. Be cautious. So this is another aspect. You can run into people from time to time. Uh, you casually talk to them. Just, let's just trade. Uh, nope. All right. Doesn't take your eye. Maybe next time I have something you want. It's a nice beat. All right. We solved that without combat, but sometimes you can get into fights and stuff there, so it's a little dangerous. But uh, let's see. It's found a small house. Might find some stuff useful in there. Got a light bulb. <laughs> Hilarious. Seeing as I just traded away my wiring. We need more lights. Let's see. Put more fuel in here. Add fuel. Before everything goes out again. Small house of wasteland. Yeah, go ahead, check it out. See what's inside. How's this doing? 42% on that filter. AA79 on that. Food. It's always huge. Coffee beans. Been brewed with water and a coffee machine. Ceramic beans. beans. So let the pot of coffee and you drunk to release thirst and tiredness. Huh. Alright. Useful if someone loses a leg, otherwise it looks like it can be recycled. Eh, fuck it, might as well take it. Wood. May as well take it, just to have it. Not really finding what we want, but we did find a lot of rope. Let's see, what is this at now? Shower integrity is at 36%. Yeah, you're fucking just useless here. Go ahead and build a rope. Start fixing that up. We want to try and get food here. It's the goal. We want to try and survive. Do as much as we can to survive. All that good stuff. Alright, tell you what. Stop doing that real quick. Go drink. Then fix. Bam. All right, Mary. Go ahead, take a shower. Zach, go ahead and sleep. But now we have the potential to get more food, which is always nice. Yang is hungry as shit. Which is a little bad. Go do that. You gonna start meowing about food? Nope, okay. Go ahead and sleep. Mary, that's good enough. Thomas. Start taking a shower. Let's see. Now that we have rope, we potentially can build a lot more things here. Start. Well, let's might as well build another room. Honestly. Don't want you to take too long of a shower since it's not raining right now. That will use a lot of water. Once we get down to 38 water, I think we'll have you stop. There you go. Stop at 35. Zachary, go ahead and get up. 
No, you can stop doing that. Go ahead. Clean the shelter. Thomas, go sleep. Zach, continue working on this room. How much fuel do we have in here? Enough. Uh, go ahead and add fuel to that once you are done cleaning. Okay, tell you what. Feed the cat first, then clean. Sip a little water. Zach is exhausted. Go sip some water. Broadcast for traders. Zach, go to sleep. Mary, go sleep. Yang, finish the room off. And then, uh, once day seven is over, I think I'm gonna call it. But yeah, this is an uh, example of the game here. You build, you survive, and you build more to survive longer. Trying to keep yourself and your family alive as long as possible. You can get more people to join, as you saw there. I had two potential recruits. Kick them both to the curb, though, because I don't need more people right now. I don't have enough chores for people to do right now. Let's see, is there anything else I can craft that I was planning on crafting? Yes, the incinerator. Incinerator is a huge one to get. Uh, prospector kit, one equipped, insufficient, will recover more items in mines, clearings, mountain passes, and caves. Go ahead and make a spike trap. But yes, people can potentially break into your place, which is why. You make sure that the place is safe. Safe as can be, anyways. Uh, water filters at 25, huh? Thomas, put on the suit. What is this? Go ahead and start fixing that up. Back, you can get up at this point. Take a suit and go ahead and upgrade that. sleep for now. Craft item. Funny enough, don't have what I need. Uh, need one more leather for that, unfortunate. Radio. Upgrade level two. Can't upgrade that. Need a lot of wires. Go ahead and not set up enough uh, extra input. Now don't scan. Actually, yeah, go ahead and scan. Oh, no. Broadcast for those. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and end it here. This is what the game is about. You survive, you build, and you survive some more. Except it's a post apocalyptic world, so it's not like Minecraft, and it's uh, you and your family. You can't make it you and your family anyways, if you want. Thomas, what do you have this at? 46. That's good enough. Go ahead and get inside. Respond. Donna, yeah, hello. I'm just passing through the area. I wonder if you had anything to trade. Tinkerer. Achievement unlocked. Upgrade a core system. Oh, okay. Don't need the water. The 
would like the leather. I would like the leather. We don't want the. I don't need that stuff. I like all this leather personally. The hinge. The sand. All four metals. All of that. Turn the suit. Go to sleep. View this, and then we'll call it. It's nice to have treasures within the shelter. Or it's nice to have traders within the shelter now and again, even if they're a little strange. This one kept going on about lights all the time. Apparently, it wastes fuel. Good to know. Thomas, go ahead and craft an item here for me. We need a trip wire. Go ahead and start cleaning the shelter here. But yeah, this is the game. You try and survive as long as you can. You and your family. It may seem pretty simple, but it's actually pretty fun. Uh, it's quite a bit of a challenge. I just got lucky with food in this one. Last couple of other saves I had. Test runs and all of that. This is an experience the game for myself. I fucking got destroyed. But yeah. That being said, I've been your host, G Smith64. If you want more of this game, let me know in the comment section below. But until next time. I'll see you there. Peace.